Do you want to know how to create a Facebook Business Manager account so that you can start running Facebook ad for your business? Then this fresh and updated Facebook ad tutorial is for you. In this simple and easy to follow Facebook or let's say Meta Business Suit tutorial, I will show you how the Facebook ad structure works and lead you to set up your own Facebook Business Manager account so that you can get your Facebook ad account ready and start running profitable ad for your business. If you check many other Facebook Business Manager creation tutorials on YouTube, most of them use an already active or hold Facebook account to demonstrate this setup and it can be a little tricky because they can't show you everything that you need to see as many of their hard accounts have already been long set up. But I had to wait this long to make this video because I want to use a brand new Facebook account so that nothing is sketchy to you and you can easily follow me step by step and set up your own business account. Shout out to my new client who allowed me to use his new Facebook account for this demonstration. If you think that what I have done make any sense, please give this video a like right now. It will encourage me to go out of my way to keep making great videos like this. Thank you for doing that for me. So if you're ready for this Facebook business manager setup, then let's get right to it. So the first thing you will be doing right now is to log into your normal Facebook account using the www.facebook.com link. If you are already signed in into your browser, then that's also cool. Here, I will log in with my phone number. You can also use your email address also. Password. Login. Once you are signed into your Facebook account, open another tab on the same browser and type in business.facebook.com forward slash overview into your address bar and press the enter key on your keyboard. I will also leave the link in the video description. So, you need to know that the Facebook or the Meta Business Suit has three categories, which include the ad manager or the business manager, the business account and the ad account. Now, your ad manager or business manager is where your whole business assets are housed. When I say business assets, I mean the tools that you will be using for your business on Facebook and the example of assets include things like your Facebook page, your Facebook pixel, your Facebook ad account, your WhatsApp account, your Instagram account and several others that you will be using to manage your business on the Facebook or Meta Business Suit. So, it also means that your business account and ad account will be housed inside your ad manager. Your business account will also house your Facebook ad account or accounts if you have more than one. So we can say that your ad accounts are found in your business account and your business account is found in your ad or business manager. I hope that makes sense. So the very first thing we want to do now is to create the Facebook business or ad manager where all our business assets will be found. To do that, click the create an account link here. Type in the name of your business account. Here, Facebook will automatically put in your name because this Facebook account belongs to you. Here, type in your preferred active email account and make sure that you have access to your inbox because a confirmation link will be sent in there. Once done, click submit and then head over to your email inbox where a confirmation link would have been sent to you. If you can find the Facebook message in your primary inbox, then check your socials. That is where mine is here. So this is it. Open it and click the Facebook Confirm Now button. Congratulations. We have scaled the first order, which is creating our Facebook ad manager. The next thing we want to do right now is to create or add our business asset to our Facebook business account. Like I said, your business assets are the tools that you will be using to run your ad. The two most important business assets are your Facebook business page and your ad account. Though we will also be adding WhatsApp accounts, Instagram account, and Facebook pixel assets in this video. Now, we have only one business account in your ad manager, which for this account I use the name Affiliate Marketing 01. This is 
it here and now i want to add my necessary business asset to this business account so that i can use them to start running my facebook ads your own account might have taken you to the business asset page automatically mine hasn't done so so i will come down here and click the settings icon here okay so here we are in the facebook asset page the first asset I want to add in here is, is my business page. So, if you already have an existing Facebook page for your business, then we will be adding it to our business account here so that we can use it to run our ads. So, to add a business page, scroll down to the account section and click pages. As you can see, Affiliate Marketing 01 does not have any page yet. So, click the blue hard here. As I have already explained, three options are presented to us here. If you already have an existing page before now, you will click the first option. Two, if you want to create a brand new page, click the option two. And three, it's not really important to us because you will only use this option if you're working as an agency. I already have an existing page, so I will click the first option. If you want to create a new page, it's very simple. Just click the second option and follow the simple steps to create a new business page. So here, I will type in the name of my page that I want to add. Make sure you know your page name or you can also copy and paste in the page URL. I really think that knowing the page name is easier. So I will begin to type it in here. As you can see, it already suggested the page name to me. So if it is in here and you can recognize it, just as I'm doing now, I will just select the page name. This is it. So click the blue hard page button. Congratulations, your business page has been added to your business account. So I'll close. So, what if I want to add my Instagram account to this business account? I will scroll down and click the Instagram account. Once again, click the blue hard button. Scroll down and click the connect your Instagram account button. Okay, so here I can confirm my Instagram profile here. If not, you can switch account. Click continue and then sign into Instagram. Unfortunately, my client can't remember his Instagram login details as at the time of my recording, so I was not able to complete the addition process. But you go ahead and finish yours. It's just very simple. So another important asset to have is your WhatsApp account. Note here that Facebook will only allow the business WhatsApp app for addition here. So I will click the WhatsApp account, add WhatsApp account, select your country code and type in your WhatsApp number. Continue. A verification code will be sent to that number. Go ahead and type it in the code here. Continue. Done. Congratulations. Your WhatsApp contact has been added to your Facebook business account. Hang on because we still have two more important assets to add to our Facebook or Meta business account, which is our hard account and Facebook pixel. So, to hard and hard account, we will have to create one if your business account is new like the one I'm using here. So to do so, come over and click the hard account here. Hard. Again, here another three option is here for us to choose from. Go with the first option if you want to create a new ad account, which is the option I will be going with in this video. But if you already have an existing ad account, that you want to add to this business account, then go for the second option. And again, the third option is for agencies, which I don't think is important for us here. Yeah? So I will click the option one, give your ad account a name. Choose your time zone. Add your currency type in here. Next, tick the Terms Agreement box, create ad account. If you want to add your credit card detail, click the Add Payment Information link here, but I won't be doing that right now. Done. 
Congratulations, your ad account has been created and added to your business account. Finally, I am supposed to add Pixel to this account, but since my client does not have a website yet, that will not be possible for me to complete the creation process here, yeah? but I will still show you how to go about that right now. So to add Pixel, don't worry if you currently don't know much about Pixel, I will be showing you more about that later. For now, you just want to create it and get it into your business account for a later use. So to create Pixel, come here and click the Hard Asset button. Come here to Advertising and click the drop down arrow. Scroll down and click Pixel. Click Metapixel. Continue. Give your pixel a name. Here, type in your website URL and just finish up the creation process. If you want me to complete this particular step as a matter of urgency, then let me know in the video description so I can jump ahead of my schedule and record the video for you. I did another pixel video on how to set up Facebook pixel for system.io. It's a video that will help you understand big pixel setup better. That video is currently displayed on your screen. I will also leave it in the video description. You can check it up later. I will also advise that you subscribe to this channel if you have not done so already and turn on the alert notification because I'll be publishing follow up Facebook ad videos to this particular tutorial and if you watch this it will be easy for you to follow up and then with the next sequence of videos because if you keep jumping across different tutorials from other trainers it can be a little bit confusing. So if I click the whole asset tab you will see that we have added the most important assets to our Facebook business account. Of course there are more but I think these are more than enough to get your accounts going. So now that our business account is ready we can then go ahead and launch our first Facebook ad. I'm just curious is there any aspect of Facebook ad that has been challenging to you or is there something about Facebook ad that you will like me to talk about? Then let me know in the comments section below. Okay. I will only show you how to get to start running your ad in this video while in my next video I will be more explicit on how to run different types of profitable Facebook ad for your business. So to run your first ad, come and click the all to start here, ads manager, Again, Facebook is prompting me to add my payment information, so I will just do that right now. To do so, just click the payment information, choose your country, your currency and time zone. Next, choose your best option and continue. Add your card details and save your information. So now to run my ad, I will come here and click create. And from here, I can start setting up my ad. So go ahead and set up your Facebook business manager by following these simple clear steps. And peradventure you have any question for me, then I will be happy to answer you in the comment section below. Also, my next Facebook ad tutorial for beginners will start from here, so make sure you subscribe to this channel so you can continue this simple ride with me. If I give you value, then please do not leave without giving this video a like. I will appreciate it. Thank you and see you in the next one.